The one true prophet is up again. How you doing? How you doing? Now, today I want to talk to you about conversion, right? Conversion is where a prophet or a man of God converts you to Jesus or God, right? Now, normally, uh, this process can take any amount of time because until you die, you're not judged by God. You're given the opportunity to repent. Let's say you live 50 years, but you get hit by a bus or something, right? Well, anyway, anyway. <laughs> if you're hit by the bus, that's when you die, I don't know. But anyway, anyway. Um, but... <clears throat> if before you die, you convert, meaning you stop doing all the bad shit you're doing, you start dating correctly, things like that, you treat people with respect, you love them, not murder them for bullshit reasons that you come up with on the spot when uh, the man was back on base for three weeks <laughs> know what he means? know what he means and anyway um, um, if he had done something wrong he wouldn't even be talking to you then asshole and, uh, well that's the point and, uh, Daphne if, she, if I was over for, for four months would know she shouldn't kill me either, either. <laughs> but I wouldn't touch her daughter either way. <laughs> either way. Say what you want. You can say what you want. <laughs> See, when you're lying, you're dying. You're dying. Quicker than those who don't lie. Um, but I'm trying to help you. I know you don't quite understand what I'm saying. Because you got a block in your brain. You got a wall up or something. You better let that wall down. <laughs> You're mortal, man. I'm not. <laughs> Thanks for making me that way, but yeah. Uh, now, when you're fully converted, that's when you can be saved. But I, no one can force convert you, right? Unless you're trying to kill one of the two witnesses outside of what? Jerusalem. Jerusalem. And that's if I go there, then that can be in the future whenever I choose or whenever I believe I'm properly with the right people together, right? Regardless of sex or gender, but again, again, judge not the CB judge, right? Right. Now, if you judge a false judgment, well, God's free to resurrect anyone that wants to from the dead, especially a true believer. Don't you get that? Mm -hmm. How many times in the last whole 23 years do I have to tell you that? First to watch and all that other shit, and you still won't get it through your thick skull. There's only one, Shane Edward Lee, and if you fuck with him, forget the house, cause I never die. I got, how many ever lost a knee, motherfucker? <laughs> you get it? You get it now. There's only one, Shane Edward Lee, only one person telling the truth, and it's him alone. It's him alone. You see, you see. He don't care how many other Dumbasses in the false Christian church, especially the Orthodox side, who tried to take over from the Gnostics, right, and wipe them out with Constantine <laughs> on their side. Yeah, yeah. Well, anyone can, with a greater force like Constantine had, wipe out the Gnostics. Right? We see what happened. We see what happened. We know what happened. We were there then, right? Not by might nor power, but by our spirit. We know what all you did. And we gave you all a choice. We cannot force you to convert. And we knew if we went too much into it, says the disciples, Rome would have freaked out, right? So we did what we could. And uh, you understand? You understand. We couldn't just come out and tell you if you were that rebellious and you saw him on the cross, right? You knew what he was. That you're hermaphrodite. The Greeks told you. The Greeks told you about them first. Hermaphroditus, right? You didn't want to hear that. And uh, did you, Rome? Did you, Rome? You better hear it now. The true one is here. Beast! Repent yourself, or I will come for you and dress them if I have to. You think I'm afraid? Or are you afraid that you finally met your match? With all due respect, sir. Former rapist and Roman soldier who raped him. You think I don't know you still? Just because I let you do it till now, don't mean it's not your 
Butch Carter's son. You know what I mean? You all have your space of repentance. Especially if you rape the tree of life, idiot. But anyway, anyway. That was part of the warning with Adam. And, uh, and that's why he left. Went back to his other dimension, right? Where you can't get to. Because of Satan's own sword or weapon or weapon. He feared it more than he feared Jesus. <laughs> It sort of killed him for 72 hours, but he was resurrected too there. <laughs> this is just a mock way of doing it, because your only weapon was a spear. <laughs> His was a flaming sword, right? Made from the fiery mountain in heaven, right? Well, that's why he's afraid of it. That's why he's afraid of it. He made it himself, by the way. He's the first forger of weapons, like one of his sons. Remember that? Read the... Fucking Bible for your once in your life, and act like you got a brain, Mr. Reese. Don't know if it's what your name is for real, right? There are many possibilities, but you're messing with the wrong Christian today. Just stop. I forgive you if you repent and convert. If you do not, we are coming for you. You hear me? You hear me? All due respect. All due respect. Anyway, anyway. Now, to be fully converted means you accept everything in the scriptures about Jesus, not just what you're comfortable with. All right? <laughs> Anyone can do that, you know. Oh, Jesus, man. Since when did you see him on the freaking cross? In the last 2,000 years. And, uh, those who did scoffed at him and what he was. I know. Uh, the Jews, the Romans, even the disciples were a little bit afraid to tell people because of what they did to him, you know what I mean, you know what I mean. And that's why too, that's why too. They didn't fear the image of God, but their own image, they tried to replace with it, right? That was the warning to the Orthodox who tried to take over the church by military might and not by the truth, right? They tried to wipe out the Gnostics, but they were talking about them the first, second, and third centuries, right? <clears throat> Don't think they weren't working to subvert the truth either. Now, only the beast would know the word mastoids meant female breast, and it's trying to deceive you that it means chest. It does not. No. Never will, beast. Ever. No. Do you think you can get me to do some now, dumbass? The motherfucker's been attacking me since I'm 23, and uh, I'm still here. How you doing? How's your day going? <laughs> or 24, or 24. I don't know where they started all this, but... I've seen pussy before, thanks. I want a virgin pussy or let it go, let it go. <laughs> I know the difference. They bleed at least one time. And, uh, but again, don't worry about it. Jesus see what was going on. And you don't think he can become a virgin again and again and again? You get me, you get me. And all three at once appeared to Peter, James, and John, but they thought it was Moses and Elijah, like dumbasses, like dumbasses. Like there's three Elijahs, right? I don't know. No, there's three Jesuses because he can be androgynous male and female, but they didn't get that or wrote it as they thought at the time. John did it too in the book of in his Gospels. He said it was Stathos, but in the book of Revelation, he said it was my story. So that's a change majorly in the Greek. In the Greek. And that means he sort of converted, but still was afraid of the wrong. Fear not, John, those who can destroy the body and yet have no more power over you. Fear the eternal spirit that can cast both body and soul into the lake of fire. That's what you need to fear, sir. Former disciple of Jesus. Still not quite converted yet, but I pray for you all. Oh, no. That's my job. To witness to you the whole truth you forgot. <laughs> Probably too, right? 
and have you repent and come to the full knowledge and not fear those who can destroy your body. Yeah. You need them, Joyce. Fight the power. Fight the powers that be. Fight the power. Fight the powers that be. Fight the power. To the resurrection of the dead and loving them unconditionally. Unconditionally means no matter what they do to you, you love them and, uh, and you don't let them stop you from loving you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Love, honey, not rape, not power is the key, is the key. You got to fight off your rapist even if it's to the death, right? Don't let them make you think, be so afraid to die that you let them rape you, right? You can find that, you can find that. Unless you're outnumbered or in the prison system and don't have a choice, right? But even I would fight them to the death in prison. And uh, that's just me, that's just you. <laughs> but Jesus couldn't because of his... Uh, they were beating him. Stuff like that. Right. You probably didn't even remember it all, right? But the point is what? Is what... What did I tell you? It wouldn't be yours, motherfucker. You think you didn't know what you were up to? What was going to happen? And, uh, you didn't get him pregnant. He got himself pregnant, idiot. Told you that. Sperm lasts outside his body anyway. If he wanted to, even if he couldn't become two, he could just jack off, put it in this pussy, and get pregnant. Dumbass. Keep telling you that. You didn't get him pregnant. Trust me. I will not share my glory with another. Another way to say his female side, right? He knew what was going on. He knew what was going on. He knew what would happen. He read about Tamar and Dina being raped. <laughs> so don't worry about it. I keep telling him that. It's over. You can either repent now and convert fully, or I'll meet you in Jerusalem one day. I don't know when. I don't know when. I'm still fine. How you doing? How you doing? <laughs> like I said, I'm to love you all, even you, unconditionally. And, uh, but you gotta repent or convert yourself or, you know, where are you going? <laughs> and if you want to find out if you'll burn forever, you'll find out. You and Jesus both. Or whoever the fuck it is. I don't know. And if the other 11 plus Judas don't convert, plus the two that join afterwards, Paul and Math Matthias, guess where you're going? No. No more games, no more games. Quit lying, quit making my job where I have to convert 7 billion people. Almost impossible. Well, I'm just trying to figure out how to do it, how to do it without lying like you did, like you did. Still a lie. <laughs> Any half truth is what? A lie. A lie. Well, half truth after half truth, I figured it all out in less than 23 years, right? So, how you doing? How you doing? And I started telling people. The only way I could, right? Anyone who asked me or was interested, I would tell or not or not. I started with my family and friends, of course, right? And then I'm branching out to YouTube, right? Try and stop me. <clears throat> day by day. Day by day. I resurrect daily, sir. How long does it take you? <laughs> 30 Maybe four, sometimes. Mm. Well, I resurrect real quick faster than you. I can resurrect within two minutes or less, or less, if I want. No matter what they do to me, I don't even remember what they did to me. All right. So I mean, so I mean, I just reform like the Wolverine, right? <laughs> even if they were to destroy my body in acid <laughs> and completely try and, you know, Dissolve me, dissolve you. You're nothing but dust anyway. I'm the dust of the star. Not you. Hey there, Lydia. But you know who, you know. Ooh, ee, ooh, ooh, ah. Uh, ting, ting, blah, blah, bing, bing. Ooh, ee, what is that? It, it. Ew, what is that? It, it. And what is Donna, lady? What is Kona? Kona, Kona. Priestess.
be converted fully or get the fuck off my planet, says Jesus. You know what I mean? You got a short time and uh, Shane's lifetime. And, uh, maybe, maybe. You know what I mean? You know what we mean. Could be a thousand, could be two thousand, could be three thousand, could be four thousand. That's still half the time you have left. No more than ten, and, uh, or eight, and, uh, you figure it out, you figure it out. What's that to me, and, uh, when I've been in heaven since then, dumbass, and you can't even get there, you can't even get there. It's a dimension, meaning you have to be allowed in or not. We have a choice, too, right? And Jane's here now. You don't think I can rebirth him many, many, many times up to seven in the next 500 to 3,500 years? Or 4,000? Uh, or 8,000? Or 10,000? Do you think he will not return? You don't care what you call him. All he needs is one chain and it's him. And uh, it's not your choice anymore. This is about the soundboard anyway. We keep telling you that. Mm -hmm. What you're doing with this is pissing the god up. It's a wazoo, right? Especially how you get them to use it and stuff like that. We know what you do. We know, what you do. We know how you bite and them into it and shit like that. All right, gotcha. Mm-hmm. Using your body. <laughs> not your mind, not your seeing ability, but your body is your price to use it, right? Mm-hmm. Because you can't really see in reality in reality. Sorry, dear, but you can't trade your body for a career. I know. God don't play that either. We hear you, though. Yeah, he you know, knew what you wanted and, uh, and took it and took it. But you let him, you let him. You chose it, you chose it. If you choose it, and even if it's abusive, you chose it, you chose it. You gotta repent now and stop playing their game, even if you lose what your career. I know better to lose something that's not as valuable as your life. I know you need to value your life above your body, right? And then God can resurrect you or anyone too, right? But if you don't, right, you'll die like the rest, right? <laughs> but I'm the best, but you're the best. <laughs> the best don't die like the rest, right? But the rest will die until you repent, too, and are fully converted. Anyway, anyway. So it's now, what? 11-15-2007, it's 5-19 a.m. Back again. <clears throat> See the strength of God, beast. Every day, how you doing? I don't know. Bye.